And we have a Hello College tour on up of that, the community college. Ooh, I put that head down. Hey, you're YouTube. Hey. Say your hi. Come on, I came here with a hair torn on the way Arizona Current Baptist Church, uh, DEFL, developing and equipping future leaders. The hair tour with our Glendale Community College Vocational School. The report they call it on the vocational school they have more. The more body the pass or trade or he go away to our Pukuna did It's going to be a great day. Yay! We praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. <laughs> Yes, hello. hello. My name is Moses Help. Moses? <laughs> and we are discovering Hi. the good morning. Hi. <laughs> Don't do the fall of that, Kiwi. I know. I'm going to get a little hair. There. Here we are. You're going to get a little hair. 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 She's such a good mom. Awe, me put on dinner. Awe, ne, get the crowd la, mother ma take the wa, mother yalla take go watch your phone. Mother yalla take go watch your phone. Mother yalla take go watch your phone. Yeah. Awe, kewa da. My name is Arnold. Um, I will be your host today. I'll be showing you around the building. This is one part of Gateway Community College. We're very, uh, we're very unique. Um, we're the only college in Maricopa that has these programs that I'm going to show you today. So these programs are more to get you a skill to maybe go out and uh, get a job. And I'll talk a little bit more about what else these programs Leave a backpack. <laughs> so cool. What do you feel about the whole, um, the whole presentation? It was very nice, you know. Uh, he gave us very, very much like insight on what school program are. So. You find it helpful? Yeah. Cool. Awesome. What about you, Shella? Mm -hmm. You find this helpful? I found it helpful. Yeah, I did. Uh, I did not know that some community colleges were this. Well, they're not cheap, but you know, rele relevantly cheap compared mm -hmm. to universities. Yeah, right. So, and then the FAFSA, the grants, they pay very home. People pay really well. I did not know that, but I learned a lot now. Good. <laughs> Very cold in there, that's where they have all the meat, they hang the meat. Um, so they'll teach them how to cut it and then they'll, they have their display, um, they put it out here. They actually make their own sausage, their own chorizo. Um, they make a lot of their own stuff here. Um, the, the this one is called Continuous Support. We actually turn this program into what we call an apprenticeship. So that's uh, what an apprenticeship is, is you're actually going to school and you're working, and so you're actually earning money while you're learning. Um, happy to be here doing some extra work. Okay. Oh. Who so, do we have here? Uh, so we have... Hey, you um, send me the video on my phone? We have, Please. so Thank Rosa you. says uh, the church that she belongs to. They are doing a field, we organized a field trip for them to come and visit the All right. Yeah, okay. Saturday works good for them. Okay. They did a presentation and. Um, all right. Yeah. So we're just kind of going through each each one, and each of I didn't know any faculty would be here, so. Well, I didn't know I was going to be here until this morning, and uh, <laughs> so welcome to the machine program, everyone. Would you mind saying a few things? Okay. A tool or a machine. So what a machinist does is they build those tools and. Say little things like this that might go 
go on to a jet engine or something. Okay. So this one is, um, is what we call the collision repair. So what they're going to teach here, like I mentioned, is like um, to fix, like if somebody was in uh, an accident and they send their car to a repair shop. So right in here, they teach all the, um, like, they have welder, welding machines, so if there's a car that requires welding to fix like a, the fender or to weld it together. You know, cars are made from different materials now, like fiberglass or plastic even. So they have to learn all the different techniques in here, how to actually repair that vehicle. Maybe that fender or that door panel is probably going to be like nine to so on this side, this is where they teach after they repair, they're going to teach you how to paint the car. So they do the paint. So, and if and the students get to bring their own cars in here. I want an old truck like that, bro. I want to drive around 1940 style. Mm. So is, is this the public bringing their old cars? Uh, these are probably oh the my God. Oh, okay. Yeah, they wow. used to do a lot of work. Maybe, maybe they would treat them like that. Oh, they would say, ah, oh, if your car's so don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> you can visit them. Oh, it's just normal. Yeah, it's <laughs> like a lot of the times they, they do these wells and they send them to the, in, like the industry to get tested to see if they're strong wells. Sometimes it's required for the certification. But we do so many types of welding, you can do so many things. Structural welding, that's like when you see, when you're driving in, in the, and, you know, Phoenix and you see like the new buildings coming up, mm -hmm. there's some type of welder there that's doing some structural pedal. So you have to do all three at the same time. Mm -hmm. So women, they do welders because they're very detailed, uh, so they do pretty good. But that's what they use for the artwork. Women like the coloring. Um, it looks like all the shampoo stations. They probably have to keep it very clean. Um, this is probably one of those programs where the state board comes to, to monitor because of the cleanliness and stuff. It's one of those areas, so that's why you probably see all the different cleaning stuff on the side. Um, but they're also open to the community too, so like if you ever wanted to uh, come and get a haircut for affordable, but keep in mind that it's a student practicing, uh, they do those. They do those But yeah, it's really cool when you come here during the like the week when all the students are in here. They're usually playing music, laughing, having a good time. It's a really, it's a really positive energy type of program. So do they have like an Instagram where we can look at like a portfolio? Oh, you know what? That's a good question. La Bulia. I'll do my Aesthetics. All services are performed. They tell me that they want to learn aesthetician to be able to do that. I can't talk. Maybe it is like Botox, Botox, lip, lip, fillers. You know, lip fillers, but there's also something with like this. With the cheese. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So that is very popular. I would say this program out of most of the beauty and wellness one, like this one gets filled so fast. Um, sometimes it's one of the few programs where we have to create new start dates or like a wait list rather quickly um and again i think because arizona because right you got like paradise valley scottsdale a lot of those places where there's a lot of like spas and mm -hmm. stuff so but a good a good paying job you know I, I share my story to be able to to help you guys and share some wisdom um i wish sometimes like i said i don't regret i'm very happy of what i accomplished but sometimes if i go back i'm like man if i could 
did something like I, I'm sorry about the technology. I couldn't figure that part out, but it happens sometimes. So. Yeah. And thank you very much from us for taking your time off. So really appreciate it. Wow! Ooh, wait, 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 not ready, <laughs> I'll bring it in. No catching first. Thank you very much for being here, both the mentor and the mentee. This, uh, this is a very important first step for you to figure out what you want to do, right? So we talk about purpose-driven life and why God sent us here. And um, the, I was talking to Dali, and the first, the very important thing in life is to take a first step. Because coming from where we were, there are a lot of insecurities and a lot of shame associated with us. One example is you're in the classroom. You need participation, right? And you don't want to speak up because you, uh, you're afraid that people are going to make fun of your next step. Or, you know, people would think that your question is stupid. If you don't take that first step to overcome your fear, to, to figure it out, you won't be. So I, I see this as being a, taking the first step, and there are so many steps to take along the way. You will have people who've been there before, like your mentors, helping you. So thank you to the, 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 the parents and the mentors for being here. And we're going to enjoy the food here. All right. Yeah. So yeah, um, consider some of these programs because college is not for everybody. You know, it's for some people, and, not, and there's nothing wrong with that. And some of us, we go to college and we don't necessarily make more money either. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not saying one way or the other. I'm just saying these are valid programs that doesn't, doesn't cause you that much and you make a pretty good living, you know. Um, and, um, and also a Bible verse, it says, A wise heart shall acquire knowledge and the fear of the wise seek instruction. So continue uh, pursuing knowledge and uh, uh, anything that we can help you with anytime come and talk to us or let us know how we can help and again thank you to everyone thank you for your continue our journey on successful in our futures and our careers thank you for giving us a chance to